arguably our most important piece of travel tech is Google Maps offline. Now most people have used it online before because it gives us all this great information about not only how to get where we want to go, but also current traffic conditions, best routes, alternative routes, and all of that information. But did you know you can use it offline? And the way that you do that is select the city that you're going to be visiting, just like I have here. Now click down the bottom bit, this section right here. And in the bottom right hand corner, you're going to see the word download with an arrow. Click on that. It's going to take you to this screen. Choose the area you want. It might be more, it might be less. And click download. Now this is going to start downloading and as soon as that gets to 100%, we're going to have it on this phone ready to use whenever I want. I don't need an active internet connection. So that means the minute I get out of the plane, the minute I uh, am lost, I want to track where my taxi driver is taking me, any of this information, I've got it immediately. Now the other thing you'll see on the screen is this little blue dot and that's my current location. A lot of people get confused thinking that they're going to need an internet connection in order to have that blue dot. But that is not done through the internet. That's actually done through cell triangulation. There's basically three cell towers that your phone can see. Now you might not have an interactive phone connection. That is fine. It's still pinging off those towers giving you your GPS or your location. And this is how Google Maps is able to get you around A to B even though you're offline. This is such an easy hack. Get on it, make sure you have this on your phone. Give it a go today at home and make sure you've downloaded your locations for your next visit.